before. Chapter 1. Saturday night, August. Emily. Something was draped across Dad's outstretched arms. A deer? A fawn that was injured? It was sprawled and long-legged. Something that had been caught in a poacher's trap, maybe. A mistake. So this is where Dad had been all this time. In the woods and cutting this creature free. I breathed out slowly, squinted at the mist that hovered around Dad like a ghost. I took my hand from my bedroom window, leaving the memory of my skin on the glass. Then I raced down the stairs, through the hall and into the kitchen out back. Throwing open the door to the garden, I waited for him there. It was ages since Dad had brought back something injured, and he had never brought back a deer. Though I could remember helping him free a roe deer from a snare in the woods once. Back then his hands had moved quickly and gently, darting from the wire on the doe's leg and then to her neck for a pulse, stroking her constantly. This was something like that again. Saving another deer could be a good thing for Dad. Something to take his mind off everything else. To help bring him out of his dark place. I heard Dad's feet scuff on the cobbles in the lane, saw his movement. I tried to pick out the shape of the deer's body, but it was all wrong. The legs weren't long enough. Neither was its neck. I took a step towards them. And that's when it made sense. The shape. It wasn't a deer Dad was carrying. It was a girl.